Stephen A. Smith, you've got me over a barrel on this one. I, ad I must admit, I'm in big trouble in making the pick on this game because you might remember, or maybe you, hopefully you won't remember, I went in stone on this before the year. I said, Seattle will win the Super Bowl. Yes, you Seattle did. Seattle will go 15 and 1. Yes, you did. Seattle will lose in week two at yes, you did. my surprise Roll team. Roll the tape. Roll the tape. My <laughs> breakout team. San we, we, aren't, we aren't actually. I'm, I'm no. doing the tape right now. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> well, we, don't, we don't need the tape because I'm, I'm restating the tape. And why did I say that San, San Diego is going to be my breakout team and dethrone Denver in the division? You recall last year, San Diego finished strong. They won their last four in the regular season, including that Thursday night game at Denver. They went to Cincinnati and were highly impressive, winning 27 to 10 in the wild card game. And then they gave Peyton all he wanted in the divisional playoff game back in Denver and finally lost by seven, 24 to 17. So I'm thinking, OK, here we go, Chargers. And here we didn't go. On Monday night, as you know, they were up 17 to 6 at Arizona. And I have a lot of respect for Arizona, but still up 17 to 6. And you know the rest of the story. Phillip Rivers muffs or misses a shotgun snap. They're in field goal range. They're out of field goal range. Then they let Carson Palmer out of jail. It's third and 10 at his nine yard line. He ran for a first down. And all of a sudden, Arizona wins the opener 18 to 17. And my team, quote unquote, is in trouble because here comes a Seattle that was even more dominant in its open opener against Green Bay than even I thought Seattle would be. There was only one weakness I saw on opening night, and that was Earl Thomas, high risk, high reward, trying to return punts. He's, he's, they replaced him, and they went, they went low risk, low reward yeah. with Brian Walters. He's not going to return any for touchdowns, but I'm pretty sure he can catch the punt, or fair catch the punt. So weakness averted. That's, that's the only weakness they have. They're, 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 they're flawless. And not only that, but they've had 10 days to get ready for the Chargers, who have had a short week to prepare, even at home, for here come the Seahawks. Uh, so, uh, so, 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 Stephen, I, let me finish yeah. real quick. I, I, would, I would go go Ron Burgundy here, but no. I can't say that on TV. You know, like, I can't, I can't say that on TV. So I give up. No, I cannot. I can't say it, but you know what I'm thinking? I, I'm dead. I'm dead. Well, well, well I, I'm just saying to you, I'm just saying to you, Skip, I, what I was trying to interject yes. was to ask a question. Are you modifying or going against the courage of your convictions? I mean, I, I mean, what are we doing here? I need clarity, Skip. Yes. Okay. I don't understand. I don't comprehend. What is it that you're saying, Skip? Okay, here's are what you I'm saying. saying. Are you saying that you're going to retract your statement mm -hmm. that the Seahawks are going to lose week two to the San Diego Chargers? Is that, I'm just asking. I'm just asking. In my 10 years on this show, have I ever retracted? No, I have not. Not on a I'm prediction. Not sure about it. I had to look that I up. I think it might have happened with the Cowboys once no, or twice. I'm just I saying. Don't do that. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I, I'm not going to do it. Mm. Here's my point. I'm going with the huge upset pick of San Diego <laughs> winning 20 to, 20 to 19, I'm saying. Okay. And I wouldn't bet. <laughs> The shirt you're wearing today on it. I wouldn't bet. 20 to 19. I, I wouldn't bet a penny on this. What, but I, I got to say it. I'm stuck. What would Ron Burgundy say? I don't, he'd say, good luck, San Diego. I don't remember that movie. Okay. I, I don't remember. All right. Yeah, good luck, San Diego. Skip Bayless, <clears throat> we all know that you're going to be wrong this week. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we, we, we just understand it. And, I mean, listen, San Diego was on a road, but they went against um, a good Arizona team. Yep. Didn't rush the ball particularly well. Ryan Matthews, as, as, as speedy as he is, only had 40 yards rushing. Something's missing, Skip. Maybe it's age. Maybe it's attrition. I know he's still talented. I know he's still in the start lineup. But Antonio Gates doesn't seem to be the same. Okay. It, 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 it just doesn't. I know he had six receptions, 81 yards. He knows how to be effective. I get all of that. But he ain't going against the league. He wasn't going against the Legion of Boom. He is this weekend. Now, I will say this to you. There is hope. There is a silver lining, Skip Bayless. And that would be the fact that the game is not in Seattle. It's in San Diego. Yeah. So being on your home turf, your home opener against the Super Bowl champions, you know that the Chargers are going to be riled up, ready to go. You know they're going to be hyped for this game. You know the crowd in San Diego is going to be hyped for this game. We get all of that. I still think they're losing this game. But I'm not going to sleep on the Chargers 
trying to make this interesting. It's at the end of the day, Phillip Rivers can ball. I believe in Phillip Rivers, but not in comparison to that bad man that was just bad last week against Seattle and Aaron Rodgers. Mm -hmm. And to me, Phillip Rivers is a stationary target. And he's going to have some problems against this defense <clears throat> known as the Seattle Seahawks, the Legion of Boom. I can't see San Diego winning this game. I see the Seattle Seahawks led by Russell Wilson with the Percy Harvin, with the dog Bo- uh, 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 Doug Baldwin, with this guy, Ricardo Lockett, who I like. Yeah. I like what I see oh, from I. him thus far. And, of course, Beast Mode, Marshawn Lynch. I don't see I, – I mean, listen, I don't have to get into the defense. We know that. Not only do I think San Diego is going to lose, I still give them credit for this. I believe that Phillip Rivers is going to try Richard Sherman. I don't think he, along with McCoy, is going to run from Richard Sherman all game long. Like Aaron Rodgers did. We'll talk I about think that, they're gonna though, try Stephen A. Uh, later we're, on the show. We are going to talk about that. that but, but wait a second. got to ask. Is that a good thing or a bad thing that you're talking about here? I think it's going to be a bad thing, okay. but I still applaud the attempt. All right. I, I agree. So my last question to you is, given how much respect you have gained no. for Seattle, are you ready to retract your Super Bowl prediction of New England over New Orleans? It's nah, too early. Not yet. Not yet, not yet? because yeah. I need I need to see a couple of more games yeah. from New Orleans to see who they really are defensively before I, I make that modification.